Hello everyone, this is Moshe the Electric Israeli and thank you for joining my channel. If you are new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all my patrons. Your support is really appreciated and thank you for those who order their Tesla using my link. I have 17,000 free supercharging miles just because of you so thank you so much and those who use my link of course you got also some free supercharging uh there's about a week left to order the tesla and get the full uh three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars uh a federal tax incentive but and i'm going to get to the federal tax incentive in a minute because uh tesla stuck today uh lost a little bit more than seven dollars was uh, up uh, as far as ten dollars in the in the red uh, after really a good month uh of gaining almost uh more than thirty dollars uh since it's uh, uh, low uh, the month before uh, after all the bad news and that's uh, due and thank to of course goldman sachs i can change their name to goldman suck um and because of their brilliant analysis i'll get to them in a minute but basically uh, they're talking about that a uh, quarter two demand is basically the uh, the ceiling that uh, tesla is going to reach uh, even if they uh, match uh, their all-time record of 90,700 deliveries uh this is it this is the biggest uh that they can get and that's because uh the federal tax is uh going uh, to cut by half at the end of this week which is true and thus uh no it's true that the federal tax is going to cut by half what they said it's not exactly true but we'll get there and uh, they say that tesla stock is now according to them it will be value evaluated by maximum of 158 dollars it's about more than fifty dollars than what it is now and uh tesla is the company as a car company that's never going to reach a million uh, deliveries a year now that's what they say the wall street uh shorts reacted they always react to stuff like this and uh they also said by the way they also say that nobody knows about how the model y is going to affect well golden uh, goldman sachs suck um uh, of course of course have a great uh, a track record of predicting anything uh, going all the way back to uh, 2008 they were fabulous and all that those who know a little bit of history understand um, uh, what what is it that we're talking about but that, that doesn't matter I want to spend uh, time on that this is just show the ignorance and the stupidity and the short-sightedness of what Tesla and what electric cars are going to do are doing and going to do uh, 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 to uh, the world uh, look at the year year over year growth of Tesla look at what Tesla is trying to do uh, that is completely different if you think that they are in the car uh, the car making business of course they are they are making cars but that's not it's a trojan horse i'm going to make a huge video this weekend about um about this topic so just wait and see you you'll see i will say a lot about it but it completely and totally misunderstanding what uh, it is uh, it is all about and um and therefore, um, I, I'm sure that uh, the uh, uh, delivers will be uh, great and it w the demand will continue. Uh, Tesla, they, listen, the tax incentives are important, but most of the people who will buy Tesla in the future is not because of this. Owning and driving a Tesla is a completely and totally different experience than one ever had. Again, I've always used this analogy, the flip phone versus the smartphone. Give me a break, okay? The smartphone costs 10, 10 times more than what the flip phone used to uh, cost and still people buy it with no incentive. I know it's not the same money. I understand the $1,000 is not the same as $50,000, but, but, that, but that's not the point. The cost of ownership is, is, is what it's all about and the driving experience and the future potential of self-driving and, um, and, and, uh, and autonomy and leveraging your car to make money. That's, that's, what it, that's why the making cars is the Trojan horse. It's the collecting of data and what's, what's the future is. And, and, and wait until this weekend. I'm going to make a big video about, about uh, uh, Tesla news and Tesla stock and what 
and and what the pro projection and the and what it's all about so stay that but just want to vent a little bit to you at this hour of the day about uh, Goldman Sachs and how it affected Tesla stock today but it's only today and that's okay it will be it will be fine thank you guys for watching stay tuned for much more meantime you can put your comments below and if you like this video give me a thumbs up help me change the world one electric car at a time and I'll see you tomorrow morning with another video